Hey, hey, everybody, this is Larry. This is me going with Q1 of the weekly contest 249, Concannation of Away. So, this one, to be honest, I feel like even as I got in 46 seconds, I felt like I could have done it faster. Uh, some of that was because if you watched the video, um, there was loading time and it was just very slow on the loading time. Um, but I was, um, but it is what it sounds like, which is that. I don't know, I think I also spent too long reading because I was just like, is this really as easy as it sounds? Um, and, you know, depending on your language, it's going to be a little bit maybe annoying or whatever, but really, you just, this is pretty straightforward to be frank. And I'm going to show you the Python solution, and that is pretty much it, really. Uh, Python has concatenation of string as an operator, uh, as an additional operator, so you don't really have to do anything else. Um, I want, I think other languages, or depending on your language, might have some as well. Um, if you're in Java, I'm sorry. Uh, but otherwise, that's pretty much it. What is the running time? It's going to be linear time because we go for each element in the array twice, and we also allocate linear space because that's the size of the output, so you can't really be faster than or, or um, use less space than that. Anyway, if you know, for a short video, you can watch me self it live during the contest next. Okay, there we go. Say what? This is way confusing, but. Is that what they want? Yeah, thanks for the support. Hit the like button, hit the subscribe button. Join me on Discord. Let me know what you think about this problem in general, how, my explanations, whatever you need to ask. Um, I'll probably put it in the comments or, you know, in a future video, what to go over. Um, yeah, stay good, stay healthy, stay cool to good mental health, and I will see you later. Bye-bye.